So this is our first video of uh, the day. What? What? Hello. What? Hello. <laughs> Testing. <laughs> right. Here we go. Julia, come, come and be next to me, <laughs> so I don't get scared. <laughs> okay. Hello. I'm Richard Vobes, Bald Explorer, out on another walk, and today. I've got a big smiley face on because we've got a bit of a party going on. The lovely Julia is here. This is uh, one of the many videos we're making up in Cumbria and Northumberland, but we're still in Cumbria yeah. and we're in Brampton. Hello, Julia. Hello. We've got a bit of a party going on because we um, we've got some friends, haven't yeah. we? Yeah. Friends and yeah. viewers. Very noisy friends. Very noisy Hi. friends okay. in the background here. Do you mind? <laughs> so there, look, look, we, we picked them up in a pub. <laughs> We picked them. We picked them up because they looked like they needed befriending. So we have the lovely Robert yes. Kosler. Yes. Hello, Robert. We need defriending. De <laughs> defriending. De uh, befriending. Befriending. <laughs> the lovely Robert Kosler and Hello. and the beautiful Cheryl Kratz. Hello. And, and, and now Cheryl, we've seen Robert on uh, some of the. You've seen me. I'll on the take other a films. step back. There no, no. we go. <laughs> but Cheryl is new to us. Hello, Cheryl. Hello. Lovely Hello, Cheryl. To, to see you and meet you. Thank you. You Lovely are, to meet you too. You are a long time friend of the lovely Julia. Yep, Julia. long standing, long suffering. <laughs> well done, girl. <laughs> and you moved up from jolly old Hampshire to get away from Julia, I believe. <laughs> <laughs> you happened? didn't get away. <laughs> <laughs> and that plan fell apart. It did. It's not working. <laughs> it's well. not working. So, anyway, the four of us are going to have a lovely time on a, a changeable weather day yes wait five minutes if you want to know what the weather's like up here wait five minutes right thanks absolutely we're in brampton this is a, 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 an old historic market town it certainly is thank you um with a, a interesting characters um yeah, we're standing in front of st martin's church we are we are and you've just dropped your glasses that's you? normal we're staying this is the town that we're staying in while we've been up in cumbria and we're going to take a little stroll um, through the town and then in a second video we're going to go up the Mott. Up the Mott and Bailey, yes. Up the Mott Perhaps and Bailey. along the ridge. Yeah. Lots of nice trees there. So shall we head off? Yeah. Let's show Game let's on. show the lovely viewers um this wonderful um is this a typical market town, would you say? Up here, yes. Up here. Yeah. Up here. Up here. <laughs> up here. <laughs> yes, this is very typical of the local area, the north. Cumbria area, um, which is dotted with market towns. There's Brampton, there's Longtown, there's uh, Alston, there's quite a few around here. But this this one's quite picturesque. Uh, it's got lots of interesting old buildings. I know about the Moot Hall, which you is a, a peculiar looking yes, building, which we'll come to. But yeah. hang on a moment, Cheryl. Hello. Hello. <laughs> Have you ever been to Brampton? No. So this is uh, new to you it then? It is new to me, yes. As well as the my, only... The only fact I have about Brampton is that my husband's school friend owns a pub here. Oh, Ooh. does he? Yes. Oh, if Perhaps only we'd right. known we could have gone in there and got some free... F um, well, we could have got this... Well, we could have <laughs> sell a load. up here, actually. <laughs> Which one is it? Nags Head? The Nags Head, Oh yeah. my gosh, right. Mm -hmm. Is yeah. that the one that they said was uh, a nice place? Um, yeah, that was the, the locals pub. It was either the locals pub or the, young, the youth pub. Pub? Pub? Pub. 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 Say the word again. Pub. Thanks. I can speak, honest. She can. Pub. So yes, it's, it's a it's a a lovely up north market town. Uh, the market hall is um, sorry. The market square is quite small, isn't it? It is. Yes, it is. But there's still a market there. Do they? Oh, they still have a market. Week, yeah, like farmers market, and, uh, veg, fruit. I think you know just general stuff. Um, I don't know what days it's on, but it's definitely on a twice a week. Um, maybe more in the summer when the tourists come. And it looks like they have um, a few little boutique shops oh, yes, in yes, here as well, boutique. like you, yes. like you might expect. Yeah. You were quite nervous about doing this because you said you're going to get some very odd looks from people. Yes. 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 And that's probably true. Yes. We, we often get a lot of odd looks, yeah, don't we? Yeah, we said, we don't mind, we're used to it. <laughs> we're absolutely used to it. I mean, have you met me? <laughs> <laughs> now, the, um, that's funny, because the Moot Hall's disappeared. We, we it's the, around the, oh, it's around it's the corner. Just, the just around hall. the next corner is right. the Moot Hall. Yeah. The only reason I'm sounding a bit confused is we've only actually once walked up into the town and on the first day that we got here, yeah. uh, and that was to visit the spa. <laughs> 
just so we could get some food. Let's have some shopping. But um, it's got lots of nooks and crannies. It has, yes. There's got lots of back lanes hidden around here. You can easily get lost. It's an absolute maze of places. There, I've said this before, and I'm full of repeats. I'm a bit like the BBC, really. Um, the there's a certain look to towns up in Cumbria isn't it yes. and I guess that's down to sorry I'm trying to get on this side of you no, that's okay. um, I guess that's because of the the masonry that they use yeah. the stone and the geology yeah, sandstone. Of the, yeah it's all sandstone up here um, it's all very solid isn't it yes. it's very solid Built very for purpose and proud yes very yes. Victorian as well a lot of this oh god yeah 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 that used to be a bank it's now a food hall for Cranston's which is a local butcher's you'll get some very nice Cumberland sausage in there oh lovely wonderful stuff and there we have the uh, moot hall in the no wait that is a bus stop I know what a bus stop looks like yes I remember it from a, a previous video yes <laughs> the moot hall is uh, that is beyond hall, wow yes. look at that yes it's quite a sight so it's, it's a clock tower yep. a hexagonal building it's got a, a bell at the top, a weather vane, and lovely steps going up and down. How delicious. It is. It's very nice. It's listed as well, I believe. It uh, looks pretty perpendicular to me. It, yes. <laughs> very good. Uh, yeah, I believe it's listed. It's very nice. It's a um, conservation area, so they can't really touch it. And so it's, it's really, really like everything else. It's built for purpose around here. And if you look, hang on a there's minute. Some, oh, yeah stocks St oh they're stocks look yes at that. absolutely look at these stocks just down here <laughs> so of course julia is going to uh, get <laughs> into the stocks well, no but we can open it up and fix you in there hey look it's a painted rock <laughs> <laughs> with the chocolate ice cream emoji oh. <laughs> Everyone wants one of those. Facebook Brampton Cumbria rocks, please post a pic, then rehide me. I like the stairs. Very nice. I'm stairs. going up them. Go on then. Coming. All right then. Oh. <coughs> wow. You get a good view from up here, don't we do. you? We do. All the way down the street. All the way down the street. Right to the bell tower that keeps oh, us yeah. awake the first night. <laughs> That's right, yes, that bell tower every quarter hour it rings julia was not impressed <laughs> nobody told me about that bit no it's going to climb down to the other side and have a look at the ball ring Absolutely. Oh. ball ring is a, is literally what it says it's a ring in which a ball would have been tethered years ago and you would well, if they did a bit of ball baiting, you'd have these dogs, yep. wouldn't they? Yep. And here it is, right here in the centre of the, the market cobbled area. So that ring wouldn't have been cemented in. And then you would have had a bull, a bit a like chain. you. Yeah, chain, absolutely. Right through, through the nose. nose. And they would set dogs on it and take bets on how many, how long it would take for either the bull to finish the dogs off or the dogs to finish the bull off there are some um, yeah on market days because we were surrounded by pubs there's only the nags head left yes. here but there was pubs all around here there are some it's, remarkable pictures uh, drawings it's hard to believe that you know that barbarism like that was seen as entertainment i mean it's still and it went some, on just some, over 100 years ago yeah it went on to about 1848 i did a yeah. thing about it yeah. in another in another video some time ago but there, i was going to try to say that there are these remarkable pictures of these bulldogs mm. up in the air where they've been upended been been bull, exactly yeah. yeah it's quite staggering yeah. what but do you think cheryl disgusting <laughs> <laughs> interesting piece of history but yes yeah it's I'm glad that stopped. Slightly earlier more they would have yeah. had um, bear baiting here as well. Would they? Oh, yeah, yeah, much yeah. earlier. Yeah. Much Middle Ages. Yeah, 14 or something. Or yeah, something. they would have caught bears and done the same that they did to bulls. Fix it to the dance or set dogs on it and take bets whether the bear finished the dog off or back the dog then. finished All the bear. All that car's off. trying to reverse into us. They are, yes, sadly. Right, Let's go around the other side, see what's on the other side.
to say I'm very taken with this building. It's a shame about all these cars though. I guess when the market day is on they clear all the cars. Here we go, look, I wonder if we can get in. Quite big in there, isn't it? Is it open? Nope. Oh, what a shame. What else is there to see in Brampton? Um, That's the most hideous part of it behind yeah, us, isn't if it? We go through the county there, council and library. Yeah, those are council offices and the local library. If we head through well, there, well, that figures, doesn't it? It's, if we, it says a lot. Yes, if we head through there, we, we can go up to the Mott with that the sounds great. Mott and Bailey. And if we head over to the opposite direction, there's Brampton Old Church, isn't there? Yeah. Here's a local in Brampton, hello. Yeah. Well, I don't live around here, but if you go down that street, there's a bit where Bonnie Prince Charlie stopped. Ooh, there the is, old, the yes. The old shoe shop uh, used yeah. to be, but it's, yeah, I don't Bonnie know, Prince Charlie stayed there. It's an antique. 1740. Yeah. And if you want to go Five. up Cape and Tree, it's where the hung of three of the four of the Cape yes. and Tree. I don't know well, where Cape and Tree is, though, even though I'm from this area. Up Gelt Road. Yes, Gelt Road. And along the turn right. Yeah. And then it's. There's a monument there, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Well, we've got a whole load of uh, local stuff to go and have a look at uh, in our own time, but we've run out of time on this video. Oh. Sorry about that, Julia. Oh. I know, I've got to put you back in your box now. Oh. Come out to play on another day. <laughs> um, we're going up to the Mott now. Jolly good. And you're going to lead the way. If you like. If you like. Well, you're <laughs> the only one that knows how to get there. Very true. In the meantime, thanks Cheryl for thank being uh, Cheryl, Cheryl for being <laughs> on the video. You're welcome. Um, and thank you for having me. That's right. You're going to be on the next one, though, aren't oh, you? Oh, okay. Yeah. We're all going <laughs> to stagger up the hill. Going to climb a big hill. Yeah. Yes. Uh, thank you very much, Robert. You're most welcome. I know. It's uh, <laughs> <laughs> outrageous. That sounds a bit. Um, <laughs> and thanks, Julia. My pleasure. Thank uh, you. We will see you on the next one. Don't forget to follow, like, subscribe, yeah. leave a comment, all the usual. But until the next one, we're having become a, a patron. Yes, become a patron. We're having a fab time in Cumbria. We'll see you next time. Bye for now. Bye.